Hello lollies, I'm back and I'm here with a tipsy talk, a new segment to my channel where whenever I feel a bit tipsy and I feel like I have something to talk about, I'm going to share it with you guys. So let's have some beer or whatever your preferable drink is, whatever it is, if it's beer or wine or whiskey or coke or water or anything. Let's, let's have a talk. The theme for this tipsy talk is single by 30. Now I am now 28. I turned 29 in November. I became single April this year and I never imagined myself being single pushing 30. But I will say this, I've never been more comfortable being single than I am right now. The great thing about being single when you're pushing 30 is that you're not afraid to have fun and get a little dirty. Whenever someone asks you for a kiss, you can say, no, I don't want this. If you feel like you could hold someone's hand, then you can. But if you want to say no, then you say no. If you want to say, this is what I want to do, then you can do that too. There's a few things I've learned throughout this time. One is that I love the time that is mine and I'm not always perfectly fine. Some days I don't feel so good and I want to curl up and cry and some days I want to talk about what happens to us after we die. Some days I want to feel the touch that can never compare. In other days I just want to sit and stare. I want to watch people walk around doing whatever they do. I want to write about it. Some days I might do it as well as feel blue and I know it's my passion and I love it so much. I want to write so bad that it's like the most vital touch. It is my life and one of the most amazing things and nothing compares to the words that I sing. The words that I sing on paper to tell a story that hasn't been told before and even though that makes me so happy, some days I do want more. Some days I want someone to share it with. Someone who doesn't mind that I already have a kid. It's the greatest feeling to be in love with yourself. To say that I want someone in my life that loves me as much as I do. And maybe I'd want that to be you. But if that isn't true for you, then we should just go each our ways and look for something else to do because life is not about making compromises all the time it's about enjoying and having fun and even though I'm pushing 30 my life has just begun and I'm so ready to experience whatever life has to offer me because this is a time where I'm happy and I'm free and I can be whatever I want to be. And I know this segment wasn't supposed to go in rhyme and I'm not sure how much you'll want to spend your time listening to me being all Dr. Seuss about being single and alone in my home. But I really love it. I feel like this has been the right thing for me to do, the right path to go. And if you don't like it, you don't have to watch this show. And I want to scream from the top of my lungs to say that even though I'm not getting married or having a second child, 
I can still enjoy being young, free and wild, or I can lie on the couch and read a good book. I don't even have to worry about whatever it is that I wear. I can walk around in the nude or with my old sweatpants on and there's no one here to tell me that I'm wrong. I can do whatever I want. I can dance around and sing from the top of my lungs. I can wash my apartment in my underwear. This is a time of my life where I've gotten to know who I really am. It's been an adventure. It's been a journey all this way. And I am so grateful every single day. I just want to live my life creative and free. I just enjoy the company of me and I don't think that I would ever find true love in this world if I couldn't love myself as much as I do today. I've had my heart broken in different kinds of way and I've had some horrible, horrible days and I've broken hearts as well. I'm not gonna lie about that, but this is where I'm supposed to be and this is where I'm at. I can enjoy life for what it is. I can smile at innocent bliss. I can sing in the shower and I can devour all of the art that I want to have around me. I can be creative without having to make excuses for anyone. I can enjoy being all alone, but I do want someone in my life at some point. I do. And I don't know who you are yet. Maybe it's you. Being single at pushing 30 means you're picky and you want someone who's sexy and has a nice smile and who's witty and you want someone who can make you laugh and someone who strokes your hair when you cry and you want someone who has some kind of answer when you ask why. Being single at 30 is pretty great. It means you don't have to make excuses when you go out on a date. You don't need the validation of some random guy but you still want to go out and have a good time. There will be people who will tell you that you need to find someone and settle down and that you don't really have the time to mess around. But pushing 30, I'm not stressed at all. I don't need someone to tell me when to fall because when I fall in love, I want it to be real. I want to have every kind of feel. I want to know that this is it because when I fall in love this time around, I want to feel my feet lift off the ground. I want to have that emotion of total bliss. I want to have that amazing epic kiss. And for anyone who will tell me that it's time to get married and get more kids, I'll tell them that I'm not ready for this. I'll tell them that if it happens, it happens when the time is right. I want to explore and I want to travel and I want to see what life has to offer at this time my life and I just couldn't care less that at this time I'm not someone's wife it's just a piece of paper I can do that later if I ever find someone that I truly feel like is my soulmate and if I find him I hope that we'll never stop to date I hope that we stay in love for as long as we can. And I hope that he's a missing man. Being single at 30 doesn't mean that you're depressed. Well, on my part, it means that I'm just not stressed. 
it takes the time that it does to find someone new and when I do I will tell you too but in the meantime I will enjoy being single and I'll have fun and go out and I'll mingle and I'll get to know new places and new faces. I like being single at pushing 30. I like being confident and being flirty and I like having this time to get to know me all over again, to being my own very best friend and I have the most amazing friends of all and I wouldn't trade them for anything at all. So this has been Tipsy Talk and some has been in rhyme and I do really appreciate that you take the time to watch the videos I make and if you make a comment or two then I'd really appreciate that too. And I can't wait to see you soon, my friend, when I return with another video again. Thank you for joining in on this tipsy talk. And now I think I'm going to go for a walk because the rhyme is making me really tired and sleepy and my head is spinning around. And I really need to get some sleep so I can get up tomorrow and get to work on time. But thank you. So thank you for being such an amazing subscriber and friend and viewer or whatever you want to call yourself here in my little corner of the internet. I'm truly grateful and I can't find a perfect way to end this video. So I'm just gonna end it with that and say goodnight.